So first we need to remove the, uh, the glass plate um, in order to be able to remove the PET tape. And once you've taken that off, um, basically these are what you're going to need. You're going to need a cloth, a vinyl applicator, um, a glass of water. Um, that's if you're using uh, detergent um, and detergent, just normal dishwashing detergent. And also you're going to need a new sheet of PET. So first of all, we need to remove the PET tape. Um, now this can take a little while, just try to pull it back on itself. And now once we've done that, you want to make sure you clean the, uh, the glass plate just to remove it, any sort of, uh, any glue or anything. So um, just give it a wipe down. Then just add a little bit of detergent to the water. Uh, just try to get it to foam up a little bit in the glass. And then what you want to do is, is make the, the glass plate nice and wet um, with the soapy uh, water. That way, uh, that when you do apply the PET tape, you can sort of move it around a little bit without it sticking. Also, get it on your hands as well, so you don't end up uh, sticking the PET tape to your hands. Okay, next thing, uh, grab that new sheet of PET, and you want to wet that up with the soapy water, again, so it doesn't stick back on itself. Okay, then what you want to do is, is as you peel the PET tape off, you want to try to keep it wet on the underside. So just make sure you're keeping everything uh, nice and soapy wet as you go. Uh, so just be gentle, you just want to make sure that it doesn't stick back on itself. Um, and just remember, I mean, you can't really get this too wet, so just go nuts on it. Um, and for sheets this big, you definitely probably want to get somebody to give you a hand um, just to make it a lot easier. Now you can do this with a window cleaner as well. Um, it works just as good, sometimes even better. Uh, just use whatever you've got, either dishwashing detergent or um, window, to window cleaner. Okay, now once you've got it off, again, make sure everything's nice and soapy wet. That's the main thing here. And then you want to try to lay it down without it basically catching on itself. Um, then grab your vinyl applicator and then just start smoothing out all the air bubbles. Uh, take your time with this. Um, the main thing is you just don't want to crinkle the PET tape. Otherwise, it's going to make your prints a little bit harder. Um, now, this is a pretty large plate, so you you're not going to get it perfect every time. Uh, don't stress. Good enough is generally good enough. Um, so just do your best. Now once you've done that um, and gotten all the air out, then you want to try to start removing all the soapy water um, off the top surface. So I generally just grab some tissues um, and just wipe it. Basically trying to dry it. You just don't want um, water dripping onto your machine um, when you place it back. So then place it back once it's dry and um, basically you're good to go. Um, what you can do is to slowly uh, heat up the bed um, and continue to sort of get any air bubbles that come out. Um, if you're printing with a raft, it should be fine, good to go.